There are plenty of reasons you may want to have more than one macOS account, but there may come a time when you're ready for them to join together into one. Here we're going to show you how to merge two macOS accounts into one, making sure that all the important data you want is together and in one place. If you have two user accounts on macOS and want to merge them into one, a simple solution would be to first back up the data of one account and then delete it. macOS doesn't offer any simpler way to merge two accounts. Here we show you how to back up and archive the data of one account, move it over to another account and lastly merge the two accounts together. Export your data. The method we'll use to merge both accounts relies on merging the local files present on the system. All the local files present in the user's home folder are saved in a disk image which can be accessed on the new account. Since the local files do not include any app backups, you'll need to export all of that separately. The first step before merging the two accounts is to export all your basic data. This includes contacts, reminders, calendars, notes, safari bookmarks, etc. If iCloud Sync is enabled on your device, your data should automatically be backed up to iCloud. This will help you easily access it on your other account by means of just turning on iCloud Sync. If you don't use iCloud Sync, you can choose to create an Apple ID and sync all the data with it. If you do this, simply log into the iCloud account on your other account and this will allow you to access your data. You can also choose to export the data from the specific apps. iCloud Drive. Open any iCloud Drive folder in Finder and copy any documents to a locally stored location. Mail. Drag any downloaded messages from the online account to a local folder on your Mac. Contacts, calendars, reminders. Use the export feature, File, Export, to extract this data. Safari. Select File, Export, Bookmarks. Notes. There's no built-in way of exporting the data, but you can use a free exporter, link in the description, to export your notes into a plain text format. Photos. The only method to transfer your photos library from one account to another is by syncing it through iCloud Photos. Merging two accounts into one. This method will merge the data of both accounts into one by deleting the old account and saving its data as a disk image. Hence it is recommended to make another backup of the data either on Time Machine or on a local drive before proceeding. This is to ensure that you don't lose any data unintentionally, of course. In the newer account, the one you want to keep, open the System Preferences on your Mac. Select Users and Groups. Once open, click on the lock icon in the bottom left corner and enter in your administrative password. Select the user account you want to delete and merge with another. Click on the minus icon at the bottom of the list. macOS will ask you how to proceed. Select Save the Home Folder in a Disk Image. Make sure you choose the Disk Image option. This will give you access to the files in it. Click Delete User and Confirm. The second account will now be deleted. Now when you open the Users directory, Finder, Go, Computer, Macintosh, HD and Users, you'll see a folder named Deleted Users. Within this folder you'll see a disk image with the name of the account you deleted. When you double click on the disk image to mount it, you'll be able to access all the files that were present in your home folder of the previous account. Similarly, you can copy the files over or import the data in any app that offers to bring the material over. You can choose to keep the disk image as it is or copy the data to any other drive as a backup. Now that you know how to merge accounts in macOS, you may also want to learn about enabling root access in macOS or how to delete files that won't delete. Links to all that in the description. Okay, as always, thank you so much for watching.